My name is Hoda. I'm from Egypt. Yes. Uh, you just mentioned that uh, it's, uh, Egypt continues its uh, position that uh, um, the withdrawal should be uh, from West Bank and Gaza and yeah. the return of the refugees to their lands. The Egyptians will not be sitting in Sinai. Can you elaborate on this? What do you really mean? I don't think you understood what I said. I said that... Uh, if I had been the prime minister, just as Israel will not give up the West Bank, I would not have given up the Sinai, and therefore you would not be sitting there, there right now. I am convinced that Egypt will eventually go to war with Israel. I have not the slightest doubt of that. What's your estimation to this peace between Egypt and Israel? I don't believe that there is. A peace. The fact that there is no war, for 11 years there was no war between Nasser and Israel. From 1956 to 1967, did that mean that there was peace? We haven't had war with Jordan now since, since 1967, and there's no treaty. Of peace. Treaty what then to you? I don't think it's worth anything. I, I would certainly hope that I'm wrong. I would be overjoyed, and, and I certainly would would not start a war with Egypt. But I don't, uh, I don't trust your uh, country. I don't trust you. about Sharon, he was uh, one party to this agreement. Yes, indeed. What in the world makes you think that if a hawk does something stupid, that it's not stupid? Uh, it was a stupid move. What in the world makes him uh, perfect? He isn't perfect. It was a terrible error, a grave mistake. And if you speak to him now, he will say so, so too. Uh, and Moshe Aaron's also, uh, he, he, was, he was at that time anti the treaty. Now he's for it. Uh, it's hard to understand people at, at times. I'm a, a consistent person at the very, very least.